obviously for just a moment, but before I do, I need a volunteer. Who's brave? Oh, wonderful. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, volunteers seem so much better when you're still seated. Come up here and tell everyone your name, please. Ira. Ira. Everyone say hello, Ira. <laughs> very, very brave. Okay. <laughs> Now, I don't know if any of you have heard this, but one of my favorite things about Bruce Lee is that when he takes on a new client, what he does is he tells them, he goes, all of the water in this glass is everything that you know about martial arts. And all of the water in this glass is everything I know about martial arts. If you want what I know, you have to empty your glass so that I can fill it your glass with mine. I'm not going to ask you to empty your glasses because I know that each and every one of you here have a tremendous amount of experience and wisdom. But I am going to ask you, can you take the tea? <laughs> She's snooping to see if it's vodka. <laughs> I wasn't going to tell her right away, so it could prove how brave she is. It's just all the water. Don't worry. Okay, so the reason why I wanted her to take a sip, you are so brave, is so that I could put just a little bit of what I have to offer in her glass to mix it up a little bit. So in order for you to get what I have to offer, you need to make some space. And what I mean by that is to let go of any current assumptions or judgments about what you might know about leadership. And allow me to just give you some of what I have to offer, and if you like some of it, start to integrate it into your world. Okay? Can we give Ira a tremendous round of applause? Thank you so much. Leadership from the inside out. It's a little different, and I believe very, very strongly in it. So this, this glass of water, holds perhaps what you currently know. This is negativity. This could be a boss who seems to come down on you a lot or doesn't show appreciation for what you do. This could be a peer who has a very different style from you. This could be um, a friend that you got into a fight with, a spouse that doesn't the garbage. This could be any number of things in the world that brings negativity. You'll see that it doesn't take a lot when you allow that negativity in to completely change how you are and how you see the world. Now, I know, and I've been told I'm not actually allowed to demonstrate this because it would make far too much of a mess. But if I were to take a very large pitcher of fresh, clean spring water and pour it in here and allow the other water to overflow, what would happen? It would, it would eventually become clear again, right? So what is that pitcher of clean spring water? It's the positive stuff. It's looking, searching for the empowering people. It's always being from a place of curiosity, openness to learning from other people and to seeking out what you choose to focus on. Because there is a tremendous amount of negativity in the world, but there is even more positive, empowering, incredible people and information. So I encourage you to continue to fill your glass with that.